As a first time person here, I have to say this is absolutely phenomenal. From the moment that you arrive and you see all the GAA jerseys around you, you see the Thai dance on the first night, you see a thousand people descending here, you see people playing all day in this 35 degree heat. It's absolutely phenomenal and it's something that every person, Irish and otherwise, should really, really see. What are the lessons you're learning from your own particular background in business? Um, many hands make light work and I have to say even though the work isn't light there's been many many hands involved in this from the local hosts from the Asian County Board themselves but also all of the individual coaches that have been lining up all week and all, all month and all year for this uh, as well as the individual players themselves um, as well as the delegation that has come across from Ireland so I think what I'm learning from this is just just how many people are involved in this but what's really striking me as well is that at home the, the Asian County Board in, in the Asian or in GA right. Deserve so much more three, recognition nine, for what they do because it's phenomenal to get this 23 years in a row, uh, 36 Nation countries here this time, 45, 55 uh, female, Nation male, gender Nation balance, Nation Nation and so on. It's really Nation phenomenal Nation achievement, Nation and it's something Nation that I'm going to take back Nation is to is to tell everybody at home what what they're doing. And the third thing is is that there's an awful lot of parallels between business and sport. Everyone is trying to work together towards a common goal, a shared passion, and the teamwork, the communication, and just the sheer amount of hard work that goes into this. It's absolutely inspirational and I'm I'm going back to Ireland just uh, speechless I have to say and that's something that's rarely said about me Jerome. Well if I gave you a job when you were back to Ireland as being in charge of the GEA and promoting it worldwide what would you do from the lessons that you, you've learned here what would be the next step where can all this go what is the potential how could it be realized? What I think would be really interesting to do is to actually bring the individual clubs around Asia, um, sit them down and ask them what really works for them and what doesn't. And I would ask them what are they doing that's really working and what particular help do they need. With a view to solely facilitating people to share their own knowledge, share their own best practices, but particularly share their experience. I think that's something that was really, um, certainly a lot of that was done on Thursday uh, at the club day because it was really great to see clubs from all over discussing things like rules, proposed rule changes, diversity, networking, Corsi Naguelga and so on like that. And I think, certainly I think that there was a lot of benefit came from that, but I think that there's, that there's an awful lot more. So what I would say is that there's an awful lot that the individual clubs have to share, share that with the other clubs around the world and with the other boards around the world feeding that back into Ireland and I think there's really something special going on here and I'm so so happy that I've got a chance to witness it at least for the first time when I'll be back. And most of all as an Irish person does it do your heart good? It does my heart amazingly good to be here just to see the sheer amount of Irishness that's packed in whether it's the sport the culture the people the music the crack um, it's really great but it, do you know what else I'm, I'm really delighted by is to see the number of non-Irish people that are here it just shows how much of an inclusive nation we've become um, how much that you know we do love the world and we're grateful to say that the world loves us um, and it, it's great to be here it's great to be here as somebody that's travelled over but to meet so many Irish people I met someone from my, my primary and secondary school here during the week and you hear stories like that throughout but it's so great to see all the different all the different cultures here but it does my heart amazingly good and that's what I mean is that everyone should get here at least once.